What is up everyone? Welcome to today's reaction video and today's reaction is to Jeff Castellucci's brand new song, his cover of Johnny Cash's Folsom Prison Blues. Um, already, straight off the bat, Jeff is not playing fair here. Jeff is not playing fair, he's not being okay because I can see on the screen just from this start screen, just from bringing the video up, not letting any of it play, we are at 0.00 and we have sexy Jeff reading what I believe is possibly Johnny Cash's autobiography from the looks of the front cover, uh, wearing sexy little glasses, looking all snatch. Then we have Jeff doing a plank, which I can only imagine is going to be a push up. And that is not a fair way to start a video. And then we got dark and depressed Jeff over on the right here. We have every stage of sexy possible right now before we've even gotten into this video. I am not going to handle this when the vocals get added. Now, I've mentioned in my home free Folsom Prison Blues reaction that this is not one of my favorite songs, personally. It just, it, it just, we, we got some, we, we got some retail trauma there with this song, as I mentioned in the home free one. But I have no doubt that Mr. Jeff is going to give me a whole new appreciation for it right here, because judging by this film clip, I'm seeing prison outfits with cut off sleeves. And thank you, Kathy, because I know that was you. Thank you, Kathy. Uh, let's get into this reaction. Please check out the original video in the description below. Give it a like, give it a comment. It's fresh out. So make sure you show Jeff some love and subscribe to him if you're not already. I know a lot of people might be subscribed to voice play, but not Jeff's personal stuff. So give Jeff a subscribe. He's amazing. Uh, I can't wait to see this. Let's go. This is Folsom Prison Blues, originally by Johnny Cash. Yeah, Johnny Cash, the low bass cover by Jeff Castellucci. I hear the train a coming, it's rolling round the bend. And I ain't seen the sunshine since I don't know when. <laughs> we made it 16 seconds, which is less than what my Discord thought I would make it. <sighs> okay, so. The reason I'm liking these covers of this song more than the original is because of stuff like that. Oh, the Johnny Cash version is kind of, I hear the dun 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 dun. It, it's very, not flat. Johnny Cash could never be flat, but it's very, very simple. Putting ooh, that kind of stuff in there makes it so much more interesting. And I like it so much more. We're 16 seconds in and Jeff has already put in something that's made me appreciate the song. And he's doing push-ups. He is doing push-ups and I can't focus on the vocals because he's doing push-ups, you guys. Calm down, Jeff. Okay, going all the way back because, like I said, he started doing them push-ups and he started singing. I couldn't even register the voice because I'm like, Jeff's doing push-ups. I hear the train a coming. It's rolling around the bend. And I ain't seen the sunshine since I don't know when I'm stuck in Folsom prison and time keeps dragging on But that train keeps rolling on down the sand I like in that transition there, it sounded like a train slowly picking up speed. It's like, it, it was like a, it like picked up speed as it went along. That was really cool. Um, Jeff's vocals, man. Jeff's vocals in this one are on a whole nother level than what I've heard in some of his solo stuff before. Like it's mind blowing already. And again, I've paused again and we're 40 seconds in. That's how good this is. Those higher range stuff that he does, my brain is never ready for it. Like his bass notes will crumple me up like a piece of paper and throw me in the trash. But those high notes, my brain's just like, how can you do those as well? It doesn't make sense. Let's get going. Come on. I hear the train coming. It's rolling around the bend. And I ain't seen the sunshine since I don't know when I'm stuck in Folsom Prison The time keeps dragging on yeah. Excuse me <laughs> Um Okay 
this part of the song, first of all, I'm going, I'm going to speak the vocals first because I have to speak about the vocals first. This part of the song is uh, much closer to what I was saying about the original, that it's kind of this fast paced, just fairly bassy, deeper thing. But putting that intro in to start with just hooked me so much. I love it. Um, this is what Jeff's doing here is much closer to the original though. But have a look at Mr. Glasses, Jeff. I'm not sure if that's Jeff, 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 or Daryl, or whatever the fourth Jeff's name is. I always forget it. But um, Mr. Jeff's just standing over there with glasses, takes them off, and then he's going to just hook them into his shirt and pull his shirt down just way too low. Sir. Okay. You don't need to make the entire internet thirsty all at once. You will break the internet, Jeff. Like. And since I don't know when I'm stuck in Folsom prison, the time keeps dragging on. Yeah. But that train keeps rolling on down the sand and on. On down the sand. When I was just a baby, my mama told me, son, I always be a good boy. Don't ever play with don't guns, play but with I shot a man in Reno just to watch him. I shot Before I even get into the fact that Jeff is playing the harmonica, before I even get into that, I just want to take him, like, I think that y'all have mentioned before that he might have a video explaining how he does this, how he does what he does. Um, I'm getting distracted by Jeff's arms on the screen, just him standing there with his arms folded. I'm getting distracted. Um, but I think, I think you said he has a video explaining how he does his mixing and everything. I've got to watch that guys. I need to watch that so badly because I am so curious. Does he sing the song and then start going, all right, in this section, I'll try putting myself behind it and record himself behind it a bunch of times. Does he have this plan in his head from the beginning? Because I can't fathom someone sitting down. You, you know, you know that meme of the guy standing in front of the whiteboard where it's got all the things connected and he looks like a crazy person. That's my brain trying to work out how Jeff puts a song together like this. And I know y'all are going to hate on me so much for not remembering what show that's from. But yeah, you, you probably know the meme I'm talking about. Either way, it's this ridiculous mind map of trying to work out how Jeff would put a song like this together because knowing the parts where he wants three more versions of himself layered over himself so that he makes himself sound better, that's too much inception for me. It makes my brain melt and it comes out sounding so good and I can't work out how he does it. It's phenomenal talent. <laughs> Don't just keep going after those bass notes. Oh my God, my body needs time to recover, my guy. Listen to that cry. Too far. I've been there's rich folks eating in a fancy dining car. Probably drinking coffee and smoking big cigars. Well, I know I had it coming. I know I can't. Oh, oh my God, already, already he had that bend on the one note he did there. It sounded so good. He started like down with bass and then brought it up higher. But then he's going to go into that deep bass section again. I think it was on free where he kind of bends it around. It sounded so good. I know. I know big cigars. Well, I know I had it coming. I know I can't. Whoa, 
that's where I'd want to stay. First of all, first of all, if there is a prison somewhere that has not only four, but seven, seven Jeffs in it, looking like that. I saw the first one walk past in the background, I'm like, is that more Jeffs? And now, now there's seven of them. If there's a prison like this anywhere in the world, I'm a travel to that place and I'm a stab a police officer just so I can get locked up for the rest of my damn life because I need to be where this is at. <laughs> this is where you want to be. Um, what was that ending? Sir, I don't even know where to begin with that. We're listening to that whole part again, you guys. I wanted to pause, but I wanted to hear it. I need... <laughs> Nope, we didn't go back far enough. Let that lonesome whistle. Let that lonesome whistle. Let that lonesome whistle. Okay, first of all, the, the three Jeffs sound so good doing the higher. Let that lonesome. And then he's going to come in with what I considered to be his bass notes. With what I thought was Jeff's bass notes going. Mm -hmm. Yep. <laughs> say about that <laughs> again I'm not a music person and I've got the memory of a goldfish so song to song I might just be blown away by the same thing over and over again but I swear that's the deepest note I've hit your I've heard Jeff hit uh <laughs> my brain is vibrating in my head right now but I can't even speak because of that note what the damn hell was that that was so deep. And we're going to see Jeff do a push-up clap in a minute. Just the fact that he's back on the ground working out again is too much for my brain to handle. Um, this man should just live stream himself working out because the internet would go crazy. He could make an OnlyFans, which is just him working out, nothing else. Nothing naughty at all, just him working out. And he'd have a million subscribers because, sir... <laughs> My God, you know, if you're skilled enough and if you have the right programs, you can set yourself up backgrounds on your computer. That's just like a GIF or a short little video repeating over and over again. I'm going to spend my afternoon right now learning how to make Jeff doing push-ups the background on my computer. That is my new computer background. It's going to happen because my Lord in heaven above, everything about that video was too much. Everything about that song was too much. And I mean that in a good way. That is not me saying, oh, it was too much. It was crap. No, no. <laughs> it was everything you want it to be. Lock me up. Um, my Lord, that man looks makes prison look good. That make, man makes prison sound good. <laughs> All right. There's like still just under a minute left. So I'm guessing George is going to, uh, George, I'm guessing Jeff's going to talk to us. Have I been saying his name wrong? I do that so often, you guys. My brain gets wires crossed. Um, when I'm not thinking right, but yeah, there's like a minute left. So let's see what Jeff's going to tell us. Talk to me, Jeff. Hey y'all. Thanks so much for watching my version of Johnny Cash's Folsom Prison Blues. Huge thanks goes out to all the fine folks at Patreon who helped create this video. There is no way I could have rented out an entire prison without them. They are the very best of folks. This man rented out an entire prison for that? You can rent a prison? They just have these things for rentals? My God, the raves you could throw at a prison would be nuts. Um, but yeah, apparently Jeff just rented out a prison. If you'd like behind the scenes footage, early access to videos, personalized messages, and all kinds of other goodies, 
head on over to Patreon to check it out. Extra special thanks to my firm but fair wardens, Aldra Draco, Helen Anderson, Sarah O, Lori Templeman, Laura Mueller, Patricia Schumann, Debbie Goodling, Jordy S, Barb Wells, A.M. Person, Angie Wooler, Carl and Melanie Thomas, Osha M. Magnestal and Dorothy Brune, and Debs Badger. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you soon. That was so good, you guys. That might be one of my new favorite Jeff ones, which is saying something, because like I said, it's not one of my favorite songs, but for him to make me like it that much, while keeping it so close to the original, mind-blowing. Absolutely mind-blowing. Uh, I'm definitely, I, I am one of his patrons. I'm definitely heading over there to uh, check out the behind the scenes because you know that's going to be an awesome, awesome video. And I want to find out if it was uh, Kathy that cut the sleeves off that shirt because I know she's done it before. I would not put it past her. She knows what we want and I thank you. I thank you very much. Um, but yeah, fantastic song, fantastic film clip. This one blew me away. I loved it so much. I'm going to watch it five more times and set it as my computer background. Uh, check out the original in the description below. Give it a like, give it a comment, subscribe to Jeff. Give this video a like and a comment and subscribe to me because it helps out the channel so, so much and I appreciate it so, so much. Uh, check me out over on Patreon where I do weekly uh, polls for voice play, other artists and home free you can vote on. I do weekly TV show reactions. We're currently working our way through uh, Our Flag Means Death, which has been fantastic. Uh, monthly movie reactions where I've just done an American Tale, which was such a cute movie. Uh, I do monthly live streams where I do six reactions and you guys all get to be in the chat uh, interacting with me and I answer questions and talk to you guys live as I'm doing the reactions. And I also, you can also get a monthly reaction request where you're guaranteed get a reaction. Some of those are coming up later this week, so keep an eye out for them. Thank you all so, so much for watching the video, you guys. Have a great day, night, morning, evening, afternoon, all that good stuff. And I'll see you next time. Bye.